Yeah. Please welcome from Entourage, Kevin Connolly, Jerry Ferrara, Kevin, Kevin Dillon, and also Doug Ellen. All right, there we go. What's up, guys? What's Kevin going on? D- Kevin Dillon overslept. He is going to be here any he second. He is en route. <laughs> oh. He is en route, but we are here. We had to Thanks leave him behind. Us. <laughs> we tried not to leave a man behind, but we had to leave him. This is live radio. So. Entourage never leaves a man behind <laughs> until this morning. Unless it's live radio. <laughs> that is awesome. Live radio doesn't wait for anyone. That's right. Uh, it doesn't. Uh, guys, thanks for coming in. I love the fact that Doug, the director, is uh, rocking the, the the conference champion Seahawks cap. That's I nice. Yeah, my Giants. Uh, my Giants are gonna hate my guts, but I uh, <laughs> we love Russell and we love you guys in oh, Seattle. We're just honorary Seahawks guy. fans. Yes, yesterday and today. For What's sure. up, Jerry? On your Instagram, running around on the practice facility. How great was that? Well, you just remember, like that was jeans and Jordan. That's why I ran <laughs> Jerry, a six eight. <laughs> Jerry is Jerry is disappointed in his forty time. He wants another crack. We may have to head back to the facility. <laughs> I didn't understand the fine art of at the start, but yeah, there was uh, that was that just aging is a tough thing to deal with. Yeah, yeah, I, I that hurt to I, I run. I thought it would be easy to kick a field goal, uh, an extra point. And uh, I bet Jerry a hundred bucks. I think there's still a hundy and, and on the table. <laughs> yeah, Russell. It, Russell was the holder, and it looked a lot more like a hockey. Yeah, but pass thank God, Kevin. <laughs> thank God, Kevin didn't kick Russell. We thought he was going to break his head. Yeah, I think you were scared there. to really lay into the kick because you knew. Ru- God forbid, excuse. you kick Russell in the hand, and yeah, well, yeah, he, he was, broke yeah. one of your bones exactly. in the filming. Yeah, I think it's only really fair. People would think it would be revenge. I was trying to break. I mean, if I broke Russell's finger, I'm sure that broke <laughs> really well in Seattle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Kevin and, and Kevin Conley, of course, who plays E uh, in the Entourage movie as well as the series, and of course uh, we. We've got Jerry Ferraro, who plays Turtle, and Doug Ellen, the director. Kevin uh, Dillon, oh, walking in. Yes, yes, John is in the house. Nice. There we go. Nice of me to join you. I can't do a show without me. <laughs> if it wasn't live radio, we would not have started without you. Buddy. They always said I got a face for radio. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, Kevin, you know, like the show always did. You know, of course, you would be the guy that they would just come in without. You know, because <laughs> well, you know, who wants to talk to the drama character, which is which is. You know, uh, Kevin Dillon, th- th- Kevin, that character is such a beloved character, uh, basically in the shadow of, of the Vince character, who's, the, who's your younger brother, who is the big star, and you're the one that actually got him into show business, and you're just trying to hang on as far as that character. You do that character so darn well, man. Oh, thanks a lot. Appreciate that. Kev's the best. Three uh, Emmy noms to back it up, too. Uh, thanks. It's thanks. so... Aw- I-, I got to see the film, and was just blown away. I love the movie. I thought it was Thank just... Oh, good. Unbelievable. It's a lot of fun. It's an amazing story. I don't even want to spoil anything, because but it's... Th- Thanks for the scenery. Oh yeah, thank you for uh, the full frontal right at yeah. the start. That's <laughs> a great scenery. Plenty of boobies. By the way, that's that not awesome. that's not a Kevin Dillon full frontal. Don't be scared. <laughs> <laughs> There's a little prosthetic involved. That <laughs> but it's funny because you know you establish you fall in love with the characters. You almost like are believing that these characters are existing. So when you watch like a character like drama succeed or some cool things happen, then I'm, in my head I'm like I got to remove myself and realize oh well it's really centering around this guy even though this guy is the, the, the guy that just can't seem to catch a break, which yeah. I. I think it's such a great, it's just such a, a cool concept. You know, that's why I love playing the guy. I love his struggles. I love when he gets kicked to the curb and he's got to get back up, but he keeps plugging away. And I, that's what I love about the yeah. guy. He's got a lot of heart and a lot of drive, and he never, never stops. And he will not be denied. He will not be will not tenacious. Denied. It seems like every generation you have these characters that everyone will relate to, whether it be Seinfeld or before that, what like Cheers or something. I'm, I'm this guy. I'm that guy. And I remember just growing up and watching the show and all of our buddies, everybody's always saying, oh, I'd be the turtle of this crew, or I'd be the drama of this crew. Is that like an overwhelming feeling as an actor to realize that you've made that kind of a connection with your audience and with your fans? I mean, I think that that just really tells us we, we did our job pretty well. Uh, it is interesting who people claim mm-hmm. every now and then you get a guy walking up saying like I'm the Vince of the group and you're like you? really? <laughs> really? So, so you're, 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 okay I didn't, I didn't see that I actually didn't see that why coming. are wow. you Vince exactly? okay so, what do you, so when, what do you, what's your unique skill? <laughs> and how does the rest unfold after you? Yeah, then? Yeah. I can't wait to see your turtle yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and it's very cool though no it's very I, yeah. I just feel like it, we just take that as a compliment like we did our job really well and uh and Doug wrote great characters. Yeah, I mean, when we, when we had LeBron on the show, he, uh, Kevin Connolly and I went to dinner with him, and he said, this is my E, this is my drama, this is my turtle. So, That's so funny. You know, we, we hear it a lot, and it's, it's a very cool feeling, and that was the goal, to try to make it a relatable show. It's, it's friendship anywhere. You know, it's really more about the friendship than it is about the Hollywood stuff, but that's the backdrop for these kind of working-class guys that, that made it and enjoy all the fantasy stuff. So. BJ and Migs, mornings on The Rock, 99.9 KISW.